Hey, 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 it's Chrissy Lulu. So, the year's coming to an end, and I wanted to kind of take a look back. Um, so, I've done a lot of art this year. If you've checked out my Tumblr, my DeviantArt, or my Instagram, all links are in the description. You'll see my um, art summary, which is just kind of like my favorite pieces, or one of them. Depending on the month, like October and May, it's kind of hard to choose which are my favorites. But other months, like January, I was like, this is a nothing month. <laughs> November, uh, I had like one thing. So, some months, it's harder. it was harder to choose than others. But yeah, it's just got my favorite pieces from each month to kind of help show my evolution. Um pieces I like more are in bigger bubbles, um, I guess. <laughs> the more important pieces, I guess. Um, the more important the piece, the bigger the bubble is not necessarily applicable, but yeah. Go check it out if you want. Um, I had fun putting it together and everything. Um, so yeah, um, in this video, uh, it's a piece based off of a little idea I had after finishing the Danganronpa game Despair Ultra Despair Girls. So, <clears throat> yep, that was kind of my inspiration. Kind of after finishing it, I was like, Kamaru would definitely be one of Togo's bridesmaids if she got married. So that was kind of the stupid little idea behind it, but yeah. So anyways, I kind of wanted to look at what I, not necessarily what I accomplished this year because I would consider this year to be a pretty big failure art-wise, um, unfortunately. Um, so this year I try, I applied to two different artist alleys um, and I made pieces for each of them, trying to get into them of course. Um, and I got into neither of them, which I'm really disappointed. When I visited the first artist alley, because I went, I'm going to both cons. Um, when I finished, or when I visited the first con, I was like, uh, I felt very disappointed in myself because a lot of the art there, I was like, I can draw better than this, and just really discouraging. But yeah, I attempted to apply to them, so that was a first for me. I've never tried applying to an artist alley before, so yeah, I tried to actually shop around a bit in the artist alley. I don't typically buy stuff from artist alleys, and it makes me feel like a horrible person because I'm an artist myself, so I should support people in artist alleys, should I not? <laughs> That's kind of the thought I have. So I decided to kind of buy stuff, pick up people's business cards. Um, you know, what's important. But, yeah. There was that. I attempted to do the Lion Webtoon comic contest. And it wasn't, didn't even get an honorable mention. But it was alright, I suppose. Um, I kind of learned a lot about comic making through that. And it took me, actually months and months to actually put together what I had. The last couple of pages were very rushed. Or, last couple of chapters, I should say. Um, if you look at my art summary, you'll see that I actually, the first page of the comic was actually drawn in January, and then I actually ended up going back and coloring it later, I think in like March. So it was a very long process. Currently, for that, I am scripting it out. I'm rescripting, and I hope to start it again. I already did a page, I want to say in November, for the new start. So I know exactly how I want it to start and stuff now. Um, I just want to work out stuff before I go much further. Um, another failure, I suppose, would be getting into my school's, my college's art show. Uh, we have a little art show in the main lobby of our art building. 
and I just had noticed a lot of people who were in my drawing class had always had at least two things in the show and I wanted to have two things in the show so while that wasn't totally up to me I did want to try and top myself and get two things in there sadly I only got one <laughs> And I'm like really disappointed because it wasn't even a, a drawing, it was a sculpture that got into the show. So when I got the sculpture in the show, I was like, oh, I'm going to do it. I'm going to have two in the show this year. I am so excited. And it's not, not at all what happened. So it's just upsetting. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll get past it. It's okay. Um. This would be my last chance to get into the show, so I just want it to be a big one. <laughs> but yeah, I've got one semester left, and it's all drawing classes, so I've got that look to, to look forward to. Um, I had a video, I guess a success for this year would I be I had one video get 3,000 views, and I'm like absolutely shook by that. <laughs> I'm so happy that I didn't think... That many people would watch the crap I put out. Um, I try my best, but I know I'm not the best editor. Um, I'm trying, but <laughs> uh, it's going to take some practice um, and time and stuff. This next semester, I'll definitely be able to post more. <sighs> the sadly, this year was just not a good year to post videos and everything for me just because I've been so busy. Oh, I had a 30-page paper to write this last semester, which I did, so I'm really proud of myself for that, but it really put my art on a hold, so, yeah. <clears throat> that was a bit of a setback for me personally. I can't really think of anything else that I did art-wise this year. I haven't, I didn't finish a single sketchbook this year. <laughs> Shame on me. Um... I experimented more with colored papers, though, so at least there's that. I might have done enough work in them to have constitute finishing a sketchbook. Um, I got a really cool sketchbook that I really am looking forward to show you guys. So, yeah. <laughs> I hope you're as excited about it as I am, because it's, like, super cool, guys. You don't even understand. But yeah, I was not able to really grow my audience much this year, so I'm kind of bummed about that. Um, I think the thing I have the most watchers on is DeviantArt, which I have like 70-something, but I get like three likes per piece. I don't mean to sound like I'm being greedy or anything, but it's just <sighs> discouraging sometimes. That's just kind of the insecurity I have about my own work. Kind of feeling like it's not worth it. Um, I think people don't want to see my stuff, but... I'll keep pushing through, uh, like I always do. I know, like, even though on Instagram I get the most likes out of everything there, but it's only, like, 40 likes on each thing. It just seems like a lot because of all the notifications I'm getting. But then I look back and it's nothing, and it's, like, all family and friends, so... I know they wouldn't like my stuff if they didn't know me. That's just discouraging. But yeah, I'm... <clears throat> gonna try to do better next year. I'll have a lot more time to devote to working on art and everything. I'll be looking for a full-time job, so... That'll be interesting. I'll be graduating... <laughs> I've got a lot of exciting stuff coming up, so I'm hoping this next year will be better. Um, I'm kind of bummed that this was not the year <laughs> that I topped some stupid piece on DeviantArt. <sighs> I'm so mad. It's got like 300 likes, or 300 favorites, or whatever. And it's from 2013, and I've not been able to get like more likes than it, and it makes me so mad got like the most comments and everything and I'm like this is a piece of crap <laughs> I want something that's new to have more likes than that something that's more deserving 
not something that's old and gross. It always makes me so mad when people go and like it. I'm like, stop it! <laughs> stop adding to the likes. You're making it harder for me to accomplish my goal. <laughs> of course, I'm not going to go out and say that to people, but... <sighs> you know. But yeah. I wanted to do a happy little scene for a not-so-happy little game. But yeah, that was kind of the inspiration. Um, a happy little scene for a not-so-happy discussion either. <laughs> so sorry if you had to listen to me ramble. Um, I think it's important to look back on your accomplishments and even your failures so you can grow from them. So that's kind of what I'm doing here. But yeah, check out my links in the description if you want to check out my art summary. Um, make sure to like this video. Let me know if you like it so I can make more content like this. Give me a little subscribe. Um, give me some motivation. Motivate me. <laughs> Just kidding. I will be able to motivate myself. Don't worry. I'll be good. But yeah. See you guys next time. I'm going to try and put some more videos out in this next year. Trust me. Hold me to it, please. If I'm not uploading, get on my case for it. <laughs> okay, seriously. Bye.